How's it going, everyone? It is Gaming for Fanatics over here, and I'm back with another video on this channel for you guys. And today we're doing a little bit of a tutorial or a tips and tricks, but a little bit of strategy uh, guide here. And uh, this is for anyone if you have ever been stuck in that position where you're just now starting the game. Like say right now, you're just you think you're a new player to the game right now. You're just now starting out to the game, or even if you're like me and you just reset your account and you didn't, you don't know, you don't know what to do. You know, you you don't have any of your towers. You don't need good strategies to use right now. Uh, I'm here. I'm, I'm gonna, uh, here to tell you the, the strategies that I, the strategy I have been using uh, for the past like 15 games, and I've just been demolishing everyone. Uh, I went 12 and 0 the first time, and then I lost one, one two more, and then I kind of lost two here and there. I, you know, I, I can't remember too much, but I know I went 12 and 0 with the strategy. So, uh, anyway, guys, let's jump into some quick play, and uh, I'm gonna tell you what the strategy that I've been using is. We're gonna play a regular solo mode because. As a new uh, uh, a new account uh, on the game, you don't want to you want to kind of save all your medallions. Don't go into the uh, battle arena because you'll be getting a lot of players who have a lot of medallions and everything. So anyway, let's get into some assault mode. Now the strategy that is the best strategy for newbies or new players to the game is uh, that you don't really you know the um, bonus is probably the most important. But anyway, say you oh hang on. <laughs> say uh, you know. Say you do, you all you have is the first, what is it? The, these these first five towers, not the not the wizard and the monkey farm, but out of these uh, first five towers that you get when you first start the game, the best the, the best strategy to use is you want the sniper for camo lead, the um, bomb tower for grouped balloons, and then you might get either one of these two. But I would think that this is going to be better, and I didn't have enough time to get the bonus because like explaining, but it's okay because this strategy is OP. Um, so what you want to do is the first thing you uh, it doesn't really matter what you do right here But I think I'm gonna go with the cannon because in case he wants to go eco We already have this set down. We're gonna go ahead and get one wizard too Because if he goes eco more than likely he's gonna be sending some reds or some grouped blues and a cannon is super good for the grouped uh, You know them grouped uh, Balloons and so that's why you want the cannon the cannon will be for group balloons the uh, ninja will be for those pink balloons or those fast balloons, uh, and then you have that. The only reason you have the sniper is is for camo lead. And what you want to do is about eh, about round eight ish. You want to place them down somewhere out of the way in the top corner. You want to put them on strong, and you want to upgrade them to the camo vision. And uh, you don't really need to put them down until like round. 11 or so, but I, I choose to put him down a little bit sooner. Oh, here comes a here comes a bit of a. I guess he's trying to rush me. Um, I don't understand what his plan was there. He just he just he did a balloon boost, but it didn't do much. He didn't even send any balloons. So, all right. We're, so what you want to do is you want to get to 350 eco. Uh, I forgot to mention that video. As soon as the game starts on round two, uh, you know, first of all you start off with a cannon and a ninja, and you're gonna get up to about 350 eco, 400 at the max because. As a new player to the game, you're not going late game. You're not going past round 15 per se. And the reason is, is because you don't have good towers. You don't have good enough towers. You get enough strategies. You know. Uh, so you want to get to about 400 eco at the max. So I'm gonna, I'm just gonna go ahead and get 400 eco. And once you get to 400 eco, then um, you would just stop, and then uh, that would be enough. See, he's gonna start rushing, and uh, these should be this should this should be able to pick him pick him off easily. Pick up this rush. Uh, no big deal there. We, we'll leak a, it's gonna leak a little bit of lives. There's no, you know, no big harm. You, it, you gotta remember in the game is you have 150 lives. Uh, you know, you leak. It's okay to lose lives. Like there's no problem le losing a little. Oh, we oh, 420. <laughs> oh, what a number. Um, but anyway, so it's okay to lose lives as long as you have, eh, about 75 or 100 uh, lives left. You're still completely fine. You can lose up to 75 lives before you have to worry about anything. Uh, there's no, there's no, there's no problem with losing lives. It's not gonna hurt you if you lose a, a little bit of lives here and there. There, it's, it's, it's better to lose a little bit of lives and then to use your balloon boost because those come in handy later on. Now, as you can see right now, we're just kind of sitting here pretty with these good towers. We got about two thousand five hundred dollars saved up just because these towers are pretty dang good. They can hold off. He doesn't really want eco, uh, so we didn't have to worry about that. Now we're gonna go ahead and get um, one sniper. We're gonna pull him down here, out of the way. We're gonna put him on strong. That way he attacks the strong balloon. We're gonna get him on. Mm, I, guess, I guess we're getting. Uh, we'll, we'll save our money. So we got. We got some camo lead uh, popping power. We could. I, I could use the ninja, but for you guys who are just now starting out, or you just now restarted your account, 
or whatever like I did uh, yesterday, then you wouldn't have the flash bomb. So I'm not gonna use I'm not gonna use him because the simple fact that you wouldn't have him if you were just not starting out of the game. So we're not gonna be using him today. Uh, the flash bomb. We're just gonna be using two. Oh my god, a little voice cry right there. <laughs> we're just gonna be using two two towers. So see, then there there it is right there. There is the camo lead. Uh, now probably one of the best rushes. Uh, now, I mean, I'll talk a little bit more about rushing on Eco if you guys want to see another video like uh, another video like that, guys. But um, uh, if you want to kill your opponent, the best rush is you know probably just this rush right here. As you can see, you're probably about to just melt him with this. It's, it's, it's probably the best. Region Zebra and Region Rainbows. It's GG. Way to go, man. Uh, that is game right there. That is the best rush. Round 13. You just, that's why that's why I've kind of been saving up money because you just wanna you just wanna you know round 13 if you wanna win you just sit flat out full on do that rush um you know sorry man I'm trying to get a new opponent up in here uh try to you know keep things flowing but if that is what you wanna do uh, if you wanna do a quick win you just gotta get that rush but um we gotta talk a little bit more about um, you know more more you know, tactics and stuff like that but this is the best strategy to use if you're like I said new to the game or you reset your account and you don't have anything else to do. Uh, any other uh, towers or anything? So, all right. So we're gonna we're gonna pull in the same three towers, and this time we're gonna get a, we're gonna get a bonus. Um, that's gonna that's that's useless. That's not gonna do. Um, a glue gunner. I'm not gonna use it. I probably won't use it, but I just don't want to spend any more uh, uh, energy because I might need it and uh, for next game. So, like I said, you want to start off. Oh, wrong key. You want to start off with uh, placing. You want to place. Uh, a cannon and then you want to place as soon as you get enough you want to place a ninja down all right and then as soon as round two hits you want to get your eco up to 350 400 at the max i mean you can keep going but it's not going to help you at all because if you keep on going and going it's really going to hurt you because you have to you know obviously you spend the money to make the money because each time you send the balloons it costs money yes but it gives you a good eco boost and now um, if you keep on and on and on, you're gonna get a better eco, yes, and you get your eco every six seconds. But if you keep on spending a lot, a lot of money, well, then uh, when it, around eight or so comes, uh, when it's like the re you can do regens and uh, yellow rushes and stuff like that, you will have enough money to build a really good defense to start. Um, you know, you will have enough money to build a defense to stop all that. So. 350 to 400 at the max is a good is a good amount. I'm gonna stop about round five. That's why you just keep on spamming until you get to about round five or you know 350, whichever one comes first. But you know, I, I usually I will usually typically go up to about round six, but round five is when you typically would uh, stop. But I'm I'm gonna go through round five and stop at the beginning of round six. Now he did the smart thing. He got a cannon to take out these group balloons. So props to him. Um, he's got a monkey ace and a cannon and a wizard. The monkey ace is a pretty decent tower once you get a little upgrade. Um, if you have the right spot, like in the spot he has it in right now, it's not too effective, but it's an okay tower. All right, we're almost to 400 eco. We're gonna we're gonna get it to 400 and okay, there we go. We got 400 eco exactly. Now we have enough to um, kind of wait. We might be able to pull some region yellow rush, maybe, possibly on round eight. I don't know. I don't really know how what he'll get, you know, in time. I don't know if he'll have enough defenses for it. But right now, I, I don't. I don't even think he has a lightning. Does he have a lightning wizard? No, he does not have a lightning wizard. Interesting by his part. He's not, so. I'm pretty sure a region yellow would, would be enough to knock him out. If we send a few blacks, that could probably do some mad damage too, because his, you know, the um, the cannons cannot see, cannot detect blacks. So, all right. So we're gonna. I think. I don't want a balloon. Okay, we're gonna balloon booster. We're gonna we're gonna use the energy. We're gonna see how much damage we can cause these region yellows. Hopefully, we can we can uh, make them maybe boost. Uh, okay. Well, it it didn't work out too well. The um, the ace did actually come in clutch for him. Uh, he didn't. If he had, if he had a lightning strike or not a lightning strike. Sorry. No, we're not playing Call of Duty here. But if he had the lightning wizard, then um, he would he really would have easily defended that. But uh, he ended up having a heli. And an ace, and that really just came in clutch for him, honestly. All right, we're gonna need some camo leads. Um, wrong, wrong button again. God dang. All right, we're gonna get these camo leads uh, rolling. We're gonna get some camo lead defense because that is coming up soon. 
and we have to get we have to be able to detect these camel lights otherwise they could be doing some devastating damage to us guys and we cannot have that um i'm pretty sure if we do some i'm pretty sure if we do some uh some kind of little move here i don't know i don't know if he, if he has anything to detect this or not i don't think he does i think we can actually end the game right here because he doesn't okay okay so he's got the wizard okay okay well he, he he's got he's got enough to defend it okay well, that kind of sucks. I was hoping he didn't have anything. Oh my god, he's, he knows the rushes. He knows his rushes. He knows his rushes. Alright, so we're, we're gonna take him out before he can take us out. Alright guys, we're, we're gonna do some. We're gonna do something a little risky. And we're gonna go full, full out. We're gonna sell everything and we're gonna we're gonna boot. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do a full on rush and hopefully we kill him before we end up dying. Alright, who, who, who's gonna die first? There we go, coming clutch. I knew he was gonna do some kind of reverse uh, rush because that's what anyway. That's the smart thing to do. If someone just does a full out rush on you, like they sell all their powers, then you just want to full out rush them because you because you know you can't defend what they're gonna rush you with if they do a full out rush like that. You know you can't defend it, so you want to go ahead and do some kind of like counter rush, which is what he did. But unfortunately, it was not enough to take me down. Uh, wasn't fast enough balloons. I, ha I had the little one or two second advantage which which led me to victory so thank you guys for watching today's video i hope you did enjoy i hope these uh tips and tricks did help you out uh just to do a quick recap uh, the best strategy to use if you're new to the game you have no towers unlocked is the sniper set them on strong and do you want to put them on one uh one two upgrades and then you want the ninja and the um cannon and it doesn't matter what you upgrade on those but Make sure you do the sniper one correctly. You want to get to 350 to 400 eco before round six for sure. Stop sending eco by then. Um, the best uh, rush to use is the regen zebra or the regen uh, rainbow rush on round 13. And um, yeah, so that's that's basically it, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy today's video. If you did, go ahead and drop a uh, big smashing like down below. Subscribe if you're new to this channel. Because I do post every other day. Sometimes I even do daily uploads. Uh, I'm not daily uploads, but I do a double upload. I used to do daily uploads, but it ended up becoming a little too much. A little too much to handle. I couldn't do like good videos like I wanted to. It was kind of like I was rushing to put them, throw them together. Didn't have time, time to edit them and stuff. But now I have enough time to do music on my videos, and I, you know, I can do, I do a little bit more editing and uh, do live commentaries like I am right now and stuff like that. So anyway, guys. That's enough for today's video. This video's gone on long enough. But anyway, I hope you did enjoy today's video. If you did, like I said, drop a huge like down below. Um, I'm really glad to have helped anyone who, you know, if, it, if this helps you at all, I'm really glad to have helped you. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Make sure to subscribe so that way you can get some more awesome content. And don't forget to click on the videos on your screen right now on the left and on the right. And hit my icon to subscribe if you are not already subscribed. Anyway. Peace out, guys.